I shouldn't do that. And this guy right here. I don't know if it'll fit. Oh wait, no. Yeah, well. Uh. Well, we're just about ready to start farming again this year. It's January 31st, and I was able to get all the plowing done late last fall. So what we're gonna do now is grab the skew treader, take it down to the shop because I'm almost certain we got at least one bearing going out on it. Might as well check the rest and get that thing all back to working order. That way, in a couple days, or I mean, weather depending, we can run our final pass on some fields and then be able to plant peas. Okay, nice and easy, Will. Let's try not to break too many things this year. Good job. Just keep her nice and steady. Stay slow. Don't drop the clutch. Nice and easy. Nice, nice. Whoa. Okay, let's see if we can just drive forward for a little bit and try and knock off some of this dirt that somebody obviously did not clean off last year. So now I gotta do it. No, it's not working at all. That's working real well. We shouldn't be too long at this pace. Just give me another five minutes, I'll be done. probably needs to be replaced or shimmed out a little bit tighter maybe but oh, there we go we finally got that cleared out it's just straight up frozen dirt I'm not even gonna waste my time with that okay so that's that let's take it down to the shop
we gotta find a bearing and seals. I'm pretty sure we, uh, yeah, right there. There. I got it right here and the seals. Oh, right there. Perfect. Okay, so the one that's got the bad bearing, pretty sure is this back one right there. Let's lift it up and make sure. It Sounds like a bad bearing. That's the one. Let's see, probably three quarters or inch and an eighth. I'm not sure. It's three quarters, by the way. Go deaf from that. I gotta get some earmuffs. Probably a wrench on the back side. Alright, now we just pull these bolts out down here. There we go, that came out. one is definitely stuck in there so okay we're gonna have to get the floor jack kind of lift up the frame there and get the weight off of that gang that way we can pull that last bolt out and then take off all those spiders get it the far bearing and uh, replace it all right let's go get the floor jack Got it. There we go. All right, now that we got all the bolts out, let's go ahead and raise the implement and drag out that gang right there. It might be a little bit heavy. Okay, you know what I forgot? I forget this every time. There's grease zerks in those holes right there and it won't come out unless you take those grease zerks out or you break the grease zerks off. Either way, this time I'm gonna be smart and take these grease zerks out before I lift this up again and it breaks the grease zerks off. Okay, now that we got those zerks out, this thing should probably lift right up and that gang should stay down, no problem. I'm just too smart, that's the thing. That'll work. Oh, 
have a look at this. Oh yeah, that's perfect. There's the cage, what's left of it. There's the taper bearings in there. Yeah, I'd say she's shot. What a piece of junk! This one actually comes with seals. That's nice. Way better. Definitely fix that bearing. 